Hey guys, welcome to Kalita Vlogs. It is Wednesday, February 12th, and the theme for this week, a little bit late, I'm sorry, is um, music. So I think from previous videos, you know how much I love music. I was taking it in college. I'm certified in a bunch of different things for music, so I, I love music. It's my big thing. Um, and I wanted to kind of show you my music collection. So um, I have a really weird way of obtaining music. I uh, I need to stop looking at myself in the little screen because it's tripping me out. Okay, so I have a really weird relationship with music. Um, it's not a relationship, but a weird way of acquiring it. So if I hear a song I really like, I'll go and find the album. And I usually get the whole album because I don't just want to hear that song. I want to hear it in terms of the whole album and why the artist put it there and I listen to the whole thing. I usually pick out, I usually end up with a favorite song that's not the song that I originally heard. So I'm going to give you an example. So I'm just going to switch to screen. There we go. Okay. So I don't know how well you can read this, but this is my entire music collection and I have 126 and a half gigs, which equals about 64 days straight of music. 21,000 items, almost 22,000 items. So I love music. So I'll give you an example. This song here, Oh Children by Nick Cave. Um, this is the song, for those of you familiar, that Harry and Hermione dance to in Deathly Hallows Part 1. And humongous Harry Potter nerd, again, you will have seen from previous videos. So I really, really wanted this song. And I got the album and I went, huh, I like his other stuff. Um, so I got the whole album and I got a full Beatles collection and I have Jackson 5 and I have Muse. But uh, I also have a lot of, uh, that's not how you spell that, soundtracks. So I have Ever After, I have Fame, I have Flight of the Navigator, I have Forrest Gump, I have Grease, Hairspray, uh, Harry Potter 6 and 1, which I need to rectify because I actually have the the discs, I just haven't uploaded them. Um, Hercules, The Hobbit, The Hunger Games Catching Fire, Into the Woods, because I did that in high school, um, Labyrinth, Les Mis, uh, this is from the movie, all of The Lord of the Rings, uh, NCIS, Rent from the Rent movie soundtrack, and I also have the Rent Broadway soundtrack, the original run, uh, Perks Being a Wallflower, Peter Pan, Pocahontas, Saturday Night Fever, Say the Last Dance, uh, Degrassi, I think that went up to the end of season five or season six. Yes, Twilight, I like the music. Uh, Walk to Remember, I do have the whole Virgin Suicides thing, I don't know why that's up here, but I do have the whole soundtrack for that. Wicked, um, the original Broadway run. Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, so that's the original Gene Wilder one. Uh, World of Warcraft, I have all the music that they've put out. Um, I have all the expansions too, they're just not showing up right now. but. Yeah, so I have all of those, but my current favorite thing to do with music, and it, this is also probably goes with the guilty pleasure list, I love Glee, and I really love Glee, and so what I do is once I have a complete season, um, I organize it so that it's all in order from start to finish how the, se how the season started, um, I make a playlist with the original version, and then I listen to that, so I get... I listen to the original version. So again, if I, so for example, Ding Dong the Witch is Dead. That is from The Wiz. Uh, the version they covered, I think, is from The Wiz. But it's from Wizard of Oz, so I haven't done this for season three, I don't think. Um, but, so I I download the song, and then I get, or not download, I, I get the song. Um, usually, though, I get the whole album because I like lots. I like having a big music collection. I like having variety. Um, so yeah, that's how I do that. And my, I wonder if I still have my Christmas playlist. I do. This is my Christmas playlist. It's very small and I want it to be bigger. It's only 610 songs, but usually at Christmas time, what I do, I have an iPod dock and I will throw up all of the Christmas music. This playlist will be the only thing on there. And I just put it on shuffle. I just throw it on there. So I have, and yeah, if I go by artist, I have this random collection here, which is a, uh, was a three-parter, I think, but Arrogant Worms and Boney M and Carrie Underwood and Disney and Enya and Glee and etc. So, I love music. Music is big, and yeah, if you look at my playlist here, you can see I have all the music from the wedding. Still, I, I like the playlist that we came up with. Get 
really fun. Um, so yeah, that is my relationship with music. So my thought is I'm going to create a playlist and I'm going to, I'm going to do a, a playlist of like my like top, let's say a hundred songs or something. Um, maybe top 50. That's, that's a lot. And I will, uh, put it on a playlist and I will link it into the description eh, at some point. I'll, uh, I'll let you guys know when I end up <coughs> putting it all together. But yeah, so this is what kind of music means to me, just exploring and um, discovering new things and not just taking a song and just kind of taking it, listening to it and then, you know, putting it on the back burner, but like actually listening to other stuff by that artist so you can figure out if you genuinely like the artist or not. Um, and kind of the arcs of their albums. I love figuring out like a story arc or a emotional arc of an album. Adele 21 is one of my absolute favorites because you watch her. Let me see if I can pull it up. So you watch her go from, you know, anger and frustration and sadness all the way to kind of yearning and, um, you know what? I'm going to find someone like you probably better but you know kind of that kind of wistful yearning thing you go from really angry you know we could have had it all to never mind i'll find someone like you and just watching the storyline essentially flow over this album is just incredible anywho so this is my music video <laughs> uh where are we here okay there we go so that's how i roll when it comes to music uh yeah, I'm. Uh, thank you for those of you who asked. I'm feeling much better today. Uh, no more casual, Abby, but uh, I'm still a little bit sore, so we'll uh, take it as it comes, I guess. But yeah, thank you guys for your very kind messages. Um, I am back to playing WoW a lot more often now. Um, uh, Love is in the air is going on. And there's a two mounts that I don't have, so I'm going to be trying to get my way to those, and I'm trying to finish the legendary quest as well before uh, Warlords comes out. So if you guys want to hop on WoW, um, I will put my Battle.net ID down in the description. If you want to add me, that'd be great. And uh, just shoot me a message whenever you like. I love talking to you guys and I love helping you out with achievements and whatnot. Um, I'm friends with one of you guys uh, from from here and uh, he and I chat pretty regularly. Uh, we were just talking the other day because it's freezing here and he's like, oh man, we have like a foot of snow. And I'm like, ha, a foot of snow. That's adorable. Anyway, because I'm a brat. Anywho, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Have a beautiful day.